Okay, let's say you were building a cabinet for an elderly lady that uh, was somewhat compromised in the upper body and able to push down. And you wanted to go ahead and put the taller lift in the sewing cabinet because she may want to upgrade to the next generation machines, which would be the 15 and a half and require the, the taller lift. Uh, obviously, if they're gonna use a shorter sewing machine then you would bring the bottom block up so that she's not having to push down so far and hard. The other option would be is to do some counterbalance uh, for the lighter machine because some of those may only be 30, 35 pounds and you're using it on a 60 pound lift. So a couple options to counterbalance is that we actually made a form and made our own concrete block that would go under uh, the sewing machine shelf. And that was simply done by making a mold to hold the concrete and then filling it. And of course the secret on something like this is you have to tap it a, a lot so that uh, there's no air bubbles in that. So this is about two inches thick. It weighs six pounds. So if you double that, you could add 12 pounds and take the difference between the two lifts. The other option would be to route in a piece of steel so that it would be underneath your table and that would give you your extra weight. This piece of steel by itself weighs just about four pounds. So you could easily triple that with another uh, sheet or a thicker. And if you didn't want to route it in, you could always put a trim edge around this as you turn it over. Okay, I think that's